All right, hey everybody, what's going on? Um, these are my thoughts on well, the video I was going to say was going to be some updates on how Bioshock is coming along and it's uploading uh, on how it's going to be uploaded and how long. Um, and my thoughts on Bioshock 2. Um, first off, Bioshock 1 getting uploaded. Let's go ahead and talk about that. Today is Sunday, and I tried getting, I tried uploading some parts of Bioshock, and unfortunately, any time, I guess, here, and I, I assume this is, I don't know if this has something to do with something with YouTube or, or what it is, but any time somebody or there is new wireless access contact to the internet meaning okay like I turn my 360 on to play some Xbox Live while I'm uploading it will instantly fail the upload and say it, uh, it failed due to an unknown error even though I know it's because I turned my Xbox on to play some Xbox Live while this is uploading um so yeah I'm going to do overnight uploads, and I'll go ahead and post this on my on my channel. Um, as for the PSN things, I got a few requests, and I'm thankful for getting those requests. And I'll I'll throw the PSN thing back on my channel as soon as you know this has been up for a day or two, just to kind of let you know what's going on. Um, but aside from that, I thought I'd need to let you know about that and that about Bioshock 2. And I'm sure some of you are thinking, oh, well, did he get Bioshock or did he not get Bioshock? Is he not doing Bioshock? Well, I, I I probably will do Bioshock. I'm not saying I'm not going to do it. But holy crap, that is like, an, you know, I really didn't think it was going to be that much different. Which it's not really. But come on now. Personally... It's like it's it's like a new breed of game trying to copy off of another game. Yet I realize they are both the same series, but and I'm not going to spoil anything obviously cuz I've only played mm, maybe an hour and a half, hour hour and a half. I didn't play that much of it, but um anyway. But anyway, where did I leave off? Ah, Bioshock 2 being a whole new breed of game. Um, yeah, if you notice, there was a splice in there, because, yes, I had some visitors come by, so I had to splice this audio in anyway. Um, Bioshock 2 being its whole, a whole breed, new breed of a type of a game. Um, Bioshock 2 is really, the controls are different, the story is... I'm not going to say it's a bad story, because it's not really a bad story, it's just a different story. Alright, it's really different. I, From what I hear, the developers, and uh, meaning the crew who worked on the original Bioshock, not the company, from what I have heard, it has been completely... They're, they're completely written out. Is, is This is well off of what I heard. This is off what I heard before I even bought the game. Um... But I did buy the special edition, which comes with a lot of stuff, which I'll probably end up doing a video on it one of these days. I, for A, did not have my camera when I opened it, and B, um, what, what else was I going to say? I was going to say something else, and I just now forgot. Well, I didn't have my camera, and uh, as, as those of you who know, um, know that Pinnacle is not working at the moment for editing like real videos off my camera and my Windows Movie Maker cannot edit it at the moment either so yeah I can't really edit a true video I can record the video keep it on my hard drive or I can upload the raw version without any editing which is what I would be planning on doing but it's going to be a few days especially the location where I'd be you know filming it and everything the, the my house when I actually film things at my house it always has crappy lighting it always sucks and I like to film it here at this area that I'm at because it just has so much better lighting so yeah if I and there's gonna be probably no interruptions unlike at my house where there would be an interruption every five seconds and I cannot deal with that 
because um, people don't take it seriously when I say, hey, I'm making a video, could you not talk to me for like 10 minutes? And they can't even give me 10 minutes of my own time, which is ridiculous. Um, but anyway, Bioshock 2 is a good game, I guess, so far, you know, it's quite different. It is a quite different breed. And the controls are different. They are different. They're the same, but they're different, and they're kind of oddly used. And how everyone said it was the same game, I was like, okay, yeah, it's supposed to be the same game. But when they meant the same game, I'm not even playing. They literally meant the same game. I mean, it literally feels like the first one, just with, personally, I think it's worse controls, and there's a little more of a... There's a more of a thing to it that I don't like uh, compared to the first one. So I do I do agree with the second one getting lower reviews as in for controls of what I've played for an hour so far. Now I know that's not a completely legit review, of course, but I'm just giving you my first thoughts on it. Um, I said like like I said on Bioshock two or Bioshock one uploading, um, it will go up soon. It will be going up over on overnights or, you know, during the day. And then Tuesday, I plan on, I believe it was Tuesday. I just, I think this week I'm just going to be editing and uploading. Um, and I'll probably end up taking my PS3 over here. Because I really want to finish Bioshock in the evenings. And this week, since it's a Thanksgiving week, I only have three days of school, so... That shouldn't be too bad at all. And all my college classes, they're all just like, no, we're not really doing anything, so... That will give me more time to do Bioshock. Um, for Bioshock 2. Um, as for Bioshock 1 uploading, like I said, with the constant internet accesses, people getting on here, there are now currently three laptops running in this household, and my grandma, who's hooked up with her desktop in the living room, which I'm seriously thinking about unplugging the ethernet for that a because she doesn't use the internet and b it just slows me down when she just plays spider solitaire so yeah as for everybody else who is here my mom and my stepdad who came to visit me from texas they are all here on their laptops and they are all accessing the internet and bogging me down just like over the summer when I tried to upload Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi 2. It took me forever to upload it, not only because it was a long walkthrough, but because everybody was freaking accessing the internet every five seconds and failing my uploads. And those uploads, you know, I could be ten minutes left after an hour and someone could access the internet, oh, instantly fail. So that's the biggest problem on why I have to upload them at night, and I hate doing that simply because I just do not like overnight uploads. But aside from that, that is what's going on, uh, and I tried getting back into, uh, this will be a side thing, but it's not really related to Bioshock, but that's really all I had to say about Bioshock, if you want to stop the video now, go ahead, this next part I'm talking about is not even really important. I tried playing Halo earlier on Xbox Live, and whoop, failed my upload, and so I was like, whatever, I'll just play this now that I'm on. And I just couldn't even stand playing Halo on Xbox Live. I don't know why, I just could not stand playing it. I couldn't, I did not, and oh, I, I can't forget to mention the Xbox dashboard. I finally turned my Xbox on and connected online after a certain period of time. And it's like, oh, you want to download this new update? It's mandatory. And I was like, well, whatever. And I knew it was coming, and then I dreaded it once I turned it on. And I was like, oh, no. So it was the stupid new update for that Connect. I don't know why they even make this update mandatory, because as far as I know, and I'm not 100% sure on this, but I don't know if you can use the Connect on the old Xboxes at all. I don't know. There could be an attachment piece. They could have a thing that's USB. I really don't know. I don't know if the Connect has it. I think the Connect has its own plug-in, but I'm sure they'll have something. Well, no, I take that back. They probably won't have something because that's Microsoft for you. But anyway, um, that's all I had to say. And until next time, um, look for Bioshock coming in at night, so I am Central Time. 
So some of you may be seeing it in the evening, some of you may be seeing it in your morning, whatever. Just that's where it's going. So if you want to keep on top of that, just watch it when you can. If you don't want to watch it, that's fine too. But that's what's going to be happening. Super Mario, who knows what's going on with that. Nobody's watching it anyway, and I really don't care. That's a game I can pick up anytime, but at the moment I'm going to finish the next Bioshock game. And hopefully I will see you all around next time.